Discovering the Horseman Within with Ken McNabb has been brought to you by Weaver Leather. Webster's Dictionary says that influence is producing change without force. If you wanted to see an example of that, you could look at Noah Webster's life himself. Noah Webster changed the way we speak the English language in America without force. He went around and he collected words and he put them together and he wrote down the definitions of them and he replaced all of the known dictionaries at that time by going door to door, store to store, on foot, selling Noah Webster's dictionary. And in effect, he changed your life a couple of hundred years ago. Frequently, we don't think about the influence we have on other people's lives, but you're influencing the people around you daily. You influence your horse. I tell riders all the time, you only have two choices. When you ride this horse today, you only have two choices. Teach him something good or teach him something bad. That's it. That's how much influence you have on his life. You're either going to allow him to get away with things he shouldn't, or you're going to instruct him into better behavior. Honestly, we have that much influence in the lives of the people around us. You frequently don't know who's watching. We were in a Walmart in Pennsylvania a couple of years ago, and I hear my youngest son, Trent, who was about 10 at the time, and you could tell he was in trouble. And so I walk around the corner, and he's throwing shoes straight up in the air, as high as he can throw them. So I walk over, and I get him, and I tell him, Trent, you have no idea. You can't do that. You don't know who's watching. You don't know what's going on. Be responsible for your actions. Don't, don't act like that. So we put everything away, got everything cleaned up, and we walked two aisles down, and this lady comes running up to us, and she said, oh my word, I just had to come say hi. I heard your voices, heard you guys talking. I watch your show all the time, and I really just had to stop and say hi. So we had a great conversation, and she walked away, and I was able to say, Trent, do you see what I'm talking about? the influence you have on other people. I'm not encouraging you to live a secret lifestyle. I'm encouraging you to always take responsibility for your actions because someone is watching. The camera somewhere is on. And you are encouraging people to either increase their level of character or decrease it. As they watch you, they're either deciding, man, I'm gonna do this because it's gonna make me a better person, or they're saying, well, he did that so I can do it too. And if it's all right for him, it's all right for me. If it's all right for him to, to speed or it's all right for him to do something wrong, then it must be okay for me too. We have a lot of influence on the lives around us. Be careful of what it is.